all right what's going on everybody we're up here at black bayou national wildlife refuge and i brought my bike and i think i'm gonna i'm gonna go ride it around oh that thing's heavy i'm gonna go ride around son and go out on the pier of course i'll i'll walk my bike when we get on the pier i don't think they want you riding on it but i think what we'll do is is we'll ride around a little bit and then we'll go on out there to the pier and so i bought i brought both GoPros. Got to get my seat back. I had to let my seat down to get it in the vehicle. All right. So let's let's go ahead and take off. Hopefully, it'll be a good ride. Some of these roads have uh, the rocks, rocks on them, but I think it'll be all right. Feels like it may, might be kind of bumpy, but I think we'll manage. It's a nice place out here. I, I'll come out here. I come out here quite a bit, or used to anyway, and take pictures of the wildlife. Here's where they, everybody parks their boats and they launch their boat right here and they go out there and go fishing. I don't know if you can see that real good, but yeah, they, they launch their boat here. And a lot of times you see the, you see egrets and alligators and see a lot and see deer out here too. I've seen quite a few deer. I turn my, turn my helmet on in case somebody tries to call me. Hello. Hopefully we'll see some wildlife up wildlife out here. I don't know, we might, might not. I'm gonna come out here again on my bike. Uh, I'm just coming out here today to just kind of see where all I can ride my bike. Ooh, that is bumpy. So we'll go down this road, maybe. I don't know. Let's see how bumpy it is. This is just pavement right here. On up here they've got it's we'll get to the rocks again. I hope I hope it's not too loud. So there's the there's some more water there. Uh, hopefully it's not too loud going over the rocks as far as the audio goes. I've got my lab mic hooked up. I'm using it instead of the GoPro audio. Now let's see. And I, I'm not going to go far down this road right here. You, you can go down this road and it goes a pretty good ways back there. Uh, but I'm not going to go far down yet. We'll ride down here just a little ways. We, you see a lot of deer out through there a lot of the times. But, but yeah, this road, it goes on back. And you go down that way. I'm not going to ride down there today. May, maybe another day we'll go down there but today we'll just we'll go down to these couple of these roads and we'll go over there to the visitor center they have a place where you can go in hopefully it's unlocked i don't know if it is because of covid but usually it's unlocked and they have uh, fish and alligators in there we'll go look at those i don't know about parking my bike and walking off from it Somebody might 
try to steal it. But we'll go down this way. Now the rocks aren't, you know, they're bad, but they're not too bad. Got my helmet on. It is kind of, does feel kind of slippery. Like the bike wants to slide a little bit. Hopefully it won't. Last thing I need to do is wreck, is wreck on this thing. But you know, really the rocks aren't that bad. I just think it's the, the road's not that smooth with all the dirt. We can't find a smoother place. But yeah, I've seen, I've seen many deer on this road. And I'm kind of curious to see if I can, if I can ride my bike on back here. I don't know if I can, I might be able to. Now right back over there, you see, uh, there's a lot of deer over there you see sometimes. This is actually the first time I've taken the, my bike off the off a paved road. So, and then here to the left here, there's a trail you can walk down. I don't know if you can ride down it. Have to look. But over there, there's a place you can walk down there through the woods. And there's a like a little platform out there you can look out over there. It's not much to it. And then there's a trail that walks back through them woods right there. It's it's not paved, it's it's nothing but grass. I try not to I try not to go back over there in the summertime because of the snakes. A lot of snakes out here. I've walked up on many of them out here. Copperheads, water moccasins. Uh, but yeah, I tell you, this is the this is the way to do it on a bike. Even though it's a little bumpy, but and it's not too bad on the bike. kind of curious to see how the GoPro footage is. I've gotten, I've gotten many uh, pictures of butterflies out here. A lot of butterflies. Of course the egrets, alligators. I've gotten a lot of pictures of alligators. <clears throat> and so let's see. This is, this right here, there's a little trail right here. You go down this trail, there's a photo blind. And it's uh, and you can walk, and it takes you. If you, I've walked it before, and it takes you back, and you end up on the lake. Now that sign there it says photo blind, and it does say has people walking there on that sign, but it doesn't say anything about no bikes. So I don't know. Uh, we'll just have to see. I may try it. I guess all they can do is tell me to leave. But I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go back there or ride my bike until it gets cold. When I know the sna snakes aren't back there. So. But yeah, a lot. A lot of people come out here and take pictures so if you do come out here and you have a camera bring your camera with you <clears throat> this over here is where the visitor center is we'll ride over in here and on some weekends they have stuff for the kids so you know bring your kids out here but this is the visitor center over here. 
and they got a, they got a place for you to park. You can go you can go right up there. We'll go see if the we'll see if the if this conservation learning center is open. I don't know if it is or no, it's not. I figured it might be closed. Yeah, it says closed. But maybe when the COVID starts getting better, they'll open it back up. They got some alligators in there and stuff like that. And then this right here, this is this is the butterfly or flower garden. It's kind of grown up right now, but you can get some get some good pictures of butterflies in there and everything. I imagine it, it probably looks better, you know, later on in the I'm not later on, but earlier on in the in the summer when they get it you know when they first do it but like here's a little walkway trail didn't say no bike so we'll ride our bike down through here so yeah it's uh and then during the winter time i don't know i can't remember how the how that garden looks but i know i know there's times where it really looks nice but you know this right here i'm riding in uh Let's see, today's date is September 12th. And so they probably haven't kept it up lately. Because it's fixing to, probably fixing to turn cool. So let's go, let's go ride down to where you first come in and then we'll go to the pier we'll save that for last there's, there's usually a lot of people walk out there on the pier <clears throat> we'll go on down here and there is another road uh, up here to the left when we turn down this road there's another road over here to the left I'm not going to ride down it. It's 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 got rocks on it, like the road we just went down. But those rocks are those rocks are worse. There's there's not many people drive down this road, so it's not you know flattened out as much as that one. <clears throat> so I probably won't ride my bike down it. But there's a bunch of walking trails out here. <clears throat> there's some houses. People live out here. <clears throat> and a lot of people come out here to have their family pictures taken <clears throat> there's a there's a little pond right there and there was actually down that road there was actually some people that uh they were taking family pictures when i pulled up there's an egret i don't know if you can see it But this is the this is the first time I brought my bike out here. Well, we'll come up here. This is where you come in. So we'll come down here. I'll show you this little bridge that you cross right here. There's a lot of people. A lot of people come over here and fish off this thing. There, there you go. Right there. Hopefully you can see that pretty good. And then the other side of it. I'm just off kind of walking my bike right now. There's the other side of it. So yeah, it's it's really nice out here. I've I've come out here taking many many pictures of that of that right there. <clears throat> so let's go back to the pier. 
and see see what it looks like and this will be my first time to see it also <laughs> but yeah when you come in you see you just come in and this is what you'll see when you first get here when you drive in see the there's the pond over there <laughs> And there, there's a road you can go down. There's really nothing to look at, but if you go down to the end, uh, when you get to the end, there's a little, there's a little trail. It's not very long at all, maybe 15, 20 yards, and they got some ponds out there. Uh, there's people's gone. People have gone back there and got some pic some good pictures of birds. I think the Rosetta spoonbill they've gotten pictures of i've seen but hopefully when we come out here we'll see some we'll see some pictures of, i mean well not see pictures but we'll see some egrets green herons blue herons maybe we'll see an alligator and i know one time somebody came out here and got some pictures of some pelicans so you know hopefully we'll see something and then i know in the evening time a lot of people that take pictures they'll come out here in the evening time and they will get there's a eagle that flies close to the pier sometimes oh and they also have <clears throat> you can also come out here and rent kayaks and you can go out there on a kayak so a lot of people do that I don't know if you want to and let's see Ooh, that was bumpy I don't know if you want to do it during the summertime but with the alligators out there but and I don't you know I don't know if alligators are out during the winter time or not maybe they are maybe they aren't I don't know but here we are so let's come up here we'll That right there, you can, that's a trail that walks through the woods. You can walk through the woods there. But we'll ride, we'll ride just a little ways down here and we'll get off in just a second. And it actually, it doesn't say we can't ride the bike here, but I don't want to ride it on the pier. So we'll get off and walk it. So let's, let's take a look, turn the bike off. Now right here to the left. Nope. My microphone came off my belt clip. But right over here to the left, I've seen little baby alligators and stuff. Hey, how you doing? All right, and you? Good. Yeah, I tell you, it's, it's real grown up. If you come out here during the winter time, it's not as grown up. Reno, you know, right in here, you can see more. Oh, they fixed that. Yeah, this is nice. They got those little posts right there. They didn't have that before. Yeah, they did a good job rebuilding this thing. on my bike helmet. Yeah, you see the lily pads out there. And all those right back over there. Hopefully you can see it. I've got the GoPro on my chesty mount, so I don't know how good it's coming out. And they got some binoculars up here you can look at, you can look through and see out there. But see, it's really nice out here. Wait a minute. I think I've ride. <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> oh. Hello. Hi. Hey, can I call you back in a little bit? I'm out here at Black Bayou. I'm riding my I'm riding my bike and filming. I pull, I know. I brought it up here in the vehicle. All right. Bye. Bye. So let's come up here and let's get a let's get a picture. I tell you, the pier's nice since they redid it. It really is. Yeah. It's very nice. Oh, and that's new, those. Yeah. This is the first time I've been out here since they fi finished it. Yeah, it looks really good. They did a good job. Yeah, I noticed these these bars here are different. Those weren't there. Yeah. Because, I mean, kids are out here. Yeah, it was those wooden things before. Excuse me, I'm no, sorry no, no, about no, that. No, so let's walk. Let's walk over here to the other side. That was my mom that called earlier. I have to I'll call her back when on my way home. I didn't ride my bike out here. I, uh oh, yeah. I tell you, I didn't ride my bike. I, well, you saw me take it out of the vehicle. Yeah, look at all that. Look at all those lily pads out there. I hope the pictures I took with my GoPro turned out good. I tell you, I got to get me some editing software for my pictures it's uh i got my if you watch my other videos you saw i i have a i got a new computer i got a mac mini with the m1 chip i got that because of well i'm doing these videos i tell you it's it's awesome editing these videos with that thing i had a windows computer that's all i've ever used is windows and I did have Lightroom, Lightroom 6. That was the last version they released that you could install. And I've used it all up until this year. And it's worked really good for me. And uh, I don't know if I can install it on the, with the, on the M1 machine. Maybe I can, maybe I can, I don't know. But, uh, I'm thinking about 
going ahead and subscribing to the Lightroom Photoshop the photographer's package so I can edit these pictures pretty good yeah look at all those lily pads there and that's that's the side we just came from over there make sure I'm still recording yeah. and this walks I'm not going to go walk back through there I don't want to leave my bike over there but yeah this uh, I'm going to buckle my strap back up on my helmet because I uh, feels like the straps flopping around in front of the lens and hitting the GoPro so but yeah it walks on back into the woods and there's walkways you can there's a, there's a walkway I'll show you we'll walk right here to the edge nobody was coming up so I think my bike will be good for now Now I tell you, I, when they had the old pier, I mean, it's it's in the same place. They just redid it. We'd walk right back through here, and we'd come around this corner here a couple of times. There's a snake laying there. So, I know everybody's gonna think, "Well, God, he's scared of snakes." Yes, I am. I don't like them at all. I'm wondering. I wonder if they redid the walkway too. <clears throat> no, it looks like the walkway's still the same. Oh, and another thing that people get pictures of are the owls. Yeah, they did redo this. They sure did. Look at that. Man, that's nice. But see, it's a walkway. It goes. It goes all the way around there, here. Probably what you do if you come through here, walk on that way and walk all around. It's a pretty good walk. So maybe we'll come out here and do that one day. But yeah, it looks like they did redid all of that. So I think they did. Now, I, now I've walked back through there before. No, several many times I've walked back where we just came from and gotten some get good pictures of birds all that stuff there's a couple coming up I don't think they're gonna take my bike oh that's the ones we were I was just talking to <clears throat> They did that they really did the walkway all back through there too. Did they? Yeah. That's why I told them I said let's walk all the way out here and then walk back. Yeah, yeah. They they redid it. It looks nice. Yeah, and a lot of people a lot of people you'll see they'll come out here and fish. During the winter time there's you don't see the lily pads out here. Maybe well, I was going to say one day maybe I'll take some of my pictures and uh, that I've taken out here and make a video showing the pictures I've taken, but I can't do that. And I lost them all when I got my new when I got my new computer. I lost all of them. I accidentally erased them off my off my external drive, so that kind of sucks. How are you doing, man? Pretty good. How's it going? I like your bike. Oh, thank you. There's a guy up there taking pictures. 
I know a lot of the ones that come out here and take pictures. I don't think I've ever seen him before. <coughs> Getting any good pictures? Couple. All right. Hello. Pretty good. How are you doing? <clears throat> well, yeah. This is this is it right here. We can get some good pictures out here, video. And like I said, if you're out here, rent a kayak and go out in it. People do that all the time out here. They'll, and sometimes you can check their Facebook page, Friends of Black Bayou. Uh, check their Facebook page out or go to their website and see if you're coming through on a certain day. And sometimes they have a thing where you go and you, uh, it's a big group goes out in kayaks. A lot of some people bring their own, but you can rent them up here, and they all go out and they go out to the eagle's nest out there. So I haven't done it, but I would like to do it one day. I think that would be fun. So Five o'clock. And you know, nobody's coming. I think I'm gonna just ride back up this thing. <clears throat> 